Hi, my name is Andy Schmaltz. I'm an osteopathic manual practitioner as well as a certified athletic therapist. I've been in private practice now since 2004. Uh, I opened Awakening Health in 2017. And prior to that, I worked in Hamilton at an excellent practice for a number of years, as well as taught full-time at McMaster University for seven years. All muscles in the body, muscle fibers, uh, have layers of connective tissue that surround them. And when a muscle's tight, it's not necessarily the muscle cell, it's the tissue that surrounds it that's tight. And in the same way, we have connective tissue that surrounds our organs, surrounds your lungs, surrounds your heart, called your pericardium. And these layers of connective tissue can also become tight. And when that happens, those layers of tissue, for example, around your small or large intestine, if they tighten up, they can start to put pressure in towards the low back. They can create uh, issues with the pelvis that cause the pelvis to come out of alignment and creates a lot of low back pain or uh, abdominal discomfort. These things can be due to old injuries and frequently are, but they can also be due to the regular wear and tear of everyday life. A lot of times what I find is there's huge correlations between what's happening in the connective tissue surrounding the organs of your digestive system and then what you're experiencing physically. If you've read up on the profession, if you're interested in getting a treatment, please feel free to book in for uh, an initial assessment or a one hour osteopathic treatment. If you're interested in learning more information about the approach, especially for your own specific medical history and symptoms that you're experiencing, we can sit down for a free 15 minute consultation, have a one-on-one -on -one talk about your own condition and how osteopathy might be able to help you. People ask, well, what kind of conditions does osteopathy treat? Well, it's pretty much anything. It can be anything from headaches and migraines, uh, chronic neck pain, which may or may not be from previous traumas, scar tissue related to uh, previous surgical interventions, you know, long-term shoulder problems that maybe have been around for 15, 20 years on and off and continuing to get worse. Uh, obviously, back pain, any of your you know, issues down the leg. Most of what we see are chronic issues because those are the ones that slowly show up out over time and don't necessarily have a clear-cut cause and sometimes are more difficult to respond with just a straight, simple treatment. You have knee pain, but the issue isn't necessarily the knee, right? The issue is that the knee is slightly out of alignment. Maybe the two bones that kind of make up the primary articulation of that knee joint are out of place, but that could easily be due to an old ankle injury that needed a walking boot when you were a teenager combined with an appendix that needed to be removed acutely in your 20s and then now a job that requires higher stress and longer periods of sitting, right? So just looking at the knee and doing a bunch of squats and stretching exercises around the knee is only going to provide mild relief because the big picture issue is much, much uh, greater, right? It's all the cumulative wear and tear in the past. So for what kind of conditions osteopathy treats, it treats pretty much any condition that you might be experiencing. Our goal is always to try to find where the root cause of the dysfunction or a pain is coming from. My job is actually really easy. I simply take what's tight or not moving properly in the body and try to get it to move. Essentially, you either push on things or you pull on things. You're either stretching them out or you're trying to mobilize them. And in that process, you get the layers of connective tissue to let go, you get the nervous system to let go, you increase blood flow to an area of the body, and healing is able to be produced. If you are the person that is experiencing more wear and tear in the body, you're starting to feel the effects of what some people call age, what I look at as more just the cumulative effect of a whole bunch of little things, sometimes old injuries, sometimes stress. If these things are starting to get to the point where you are waking up in pain, if you are having this kind of chronic shoulder that's blocking you from doing things with your everyday life, no longer cycle because you're afraid of hurting your back, it's time to take control of your health. Book in with an osteopathic practitioner, see what we can offer you for an initial assessment and subsequent treatment. If you would like more information about your own history 
and how an osteopathic approach can benefit you, feel free to sit down one-on-one -on -one for a free 15-minute consultation. We really look forward to seeing you soon and helping you on your journey towards health.